Bangladeshi Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina attended a memorial service on Monday for victims of Friday's attack on a cafe in the capital, Dhaka. 22 people were killed, including two police officers, in a standoff between terrorists and security forces. Officials and the media are going to great pains to discover how educated sons of wealthy families turned into jihadists. The memorial service was held amid tight security at a stadium in the capital. Hasina spoke with relatives of the victims. Japanese and Italian diplomats also laid wreaths of white flowers beside coffins holding the three Bangladeshi victims. Bangladesh is a country where we practice religious harmony. We love each other. We respect every religion. This was unacceptable and called for. We never expected this to happen. Most of the victims were foreign. They include Japanese, Italians, an American, and an Indian. The armed men hold up in the restaurant with their hostages during the final days of the Muslim fasting month of Ramadan. Survivors say they were asked to recite verses from the Quran. Those who couldn't were executed. The siege ended after around 100 commandos stormed the building. Investigators are questioning the lone surviving attacker.